For families looking for a fun way to wrap up summer break, a restaurant in Shelby Township offers more than just good food. Okay, there's a full arcade. Yep. Rows of cornhole for the kids or the adults, let's be honest, <laughs> and those of all ages. There you go. April Morton takes us to One Eyed Jack's for this week's Dine in the D. Yummy food, cool drinks, and cornhole. One Eyed Jack's in Shelby Township has it all, and one could probably guess how the name came to be. When we originally bought uh, one Eye Jacks, it was called the River Charity Poker Room. It was strictly a charity poker room. If you didn't play poker, you didn't come in. Um, the laws have changed for charity poker, so we knew we had to adapt. Um, so we needed to bring in other things other than poker to bring the customers in. And as you can see behind the owner, Bob Stein, one of those things they've brought in is a full arcade. We have over 30 games, all from the 80s and 90s. Uh, for a guy like myself, kind of reliving my high school years, um, the good news is, back in the 80s, they cost a quarter at One Eye Jacks, they're free. He says as long as you drink and eat, they'll give you tokens. This sounds like the perfect scenario for parents looking for that a long time while dining as a family. This is a large facility, it is 12,000 square feet, but it's not so big that you kind of lose track of your kids. Um, however, on Fridays and Saturday nights after 8 o'clock, we ask that you be over 21. Uh, so now it's time for the adults to enjoy everything that's here. Like that cornhole I mentioned earlier, kids, of course, can play during the family time here. And the nine lanes of fun are open to the public as well, play host to some big tournaments. But it's not all games here. They're serious about their menu. This is our garlic farm, uh, boneless chicken wings. We actually use an expensive uh, small bird chicken. Tastes much better. It costs a lot more, but totally worth it. We hand cut them ourselves, hand bread them ourselves, so it's not a frozen chicken nugget here. Same dish, same just boneless chicken wings. However, this is a sriracha bourbon barbecue sauce. It's our number one seller, it's fantastic. Uh, this is our Boom Boom Burger. We start off with a half pound certified Angus beef uh, hamburger, never frozen. Uh, we got some onion rings on here. Lovely uh, Boom Boom sauce, got a little bit of a kick to it, not too bad. Uh, it's also our number one seller on our hamburgers. All right, so these are our tater kegs. Basically, it's tater tots on steroids. Much larger, they're fantastic. They got a little bit of chives and bacon in there. And then we put a little sauce on top for a little extra taste. So these are our deep fried pickle chips. Again, these aren't frozen. We cut our pickles down, we hand bread them ourselves, and then we serve that with a romelite sauce. This is our mac and cheese with buffalo chicken. So the mac and cheese is a premium white cheddar cheese with cavatappi pasta and it's topped with panko crumbs. Well, April Morton joins us right now. Hey, April. Hey, Tati. All right, so I've been tempted all morning to dig into this buffalo chicken mac and cheese, and I'm going to do so in just a bit. But first, I'm always up for a challenge, and the owner here, Bob Stein, has challenged me to a game of cornhole, and he's over here waiting for me. So. Good morning, Bob. Good morning. All right, so Let's you see. ready? Yes. Now, normally these are 27 feet, but today we're just going to do five or six feet. Okay. Um, so that's, I was worried that's fine. I was going to miss the board, but from here we should not miss the board. <laughs> okay. I'll trust first. you. I'll go first. Uh, okay. Yes. All right. So let's see. Um, I'm usually pretty good at this. Last time I did this live on TV, I actually got a hole in one. So let's see. All right. Oh, not uh, today. Not about, today. All right. All right. Let's see what you got, um, Bob. When I miss the board, I tend to swear, so whoever Oh, no, 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 button, please don't swear. Yeah. Please, we're, we're, we we're daytime TV. <laughs> oh, oh we wow. Okay, so you get another chance, right? <laughs> nope, it goes back oh, to Oh, it's my turn. Okay, course. all right. It's so. two points in the hole, one point on the board. All right, all right. So let's see. There you go. Oh, nice. it was close. It was close, I'll, right? I'll knock you in. Okay, okay. you're going to knock me in. Oh, there thank you, you for that. <laughs> wow, you're pretty good, Bob. All right. So last time, last one, I want to get over to this food. So here, let's see. Oh. That was close. Was close. All we'll right. Okay, well, Bob you. has good my job. back. Bob has my back. All right. So let's head well over done. to the food here. Thanks, Bob. That was a good game. Thank good you. game. All right. So let's see. We we know that you guys, of course, have a lot of fun things going on here, but it's also a restaurant. And look Absolutely. at this delicious food. So talk to me about what we have here. We're going to get into this buffalo chicken mac and cheese in just a bit so what else do we have here uh, here we got our chicken street tacos mm. it's chicken with sriracha bourbon barbecue sauce on there and then we got lettuce tomatoes and then we top it off a little bit of boom boom sauce so it's boom got a little bit of kick sauce. on it um, you might get a little sweat on the eyebrow but it's not too bad all right so what do we have here this looks delicious this is our chicken wings mm -hmm. uh, as we talked earlier uh, we buy a very expensive chicken uh, most chickens are about 25 pounds so you get kind of rubbery and they don't taste very well mm. so we buy what we call a small bird chicken um, 
much more expensive, but far worth it. So it tastes like chicken, they're all nice and juicy. Yeah. Um, so yeah. it's really good. We hand bread them ourselves, so we're not okay. buying frozen chicken. We cut them down, hand bread them ourselves. I love it. I love yes, the non-frozen thing. Yes, I absolutely. love that. And this burger looks absolutely delicious. Yep. Look how huge this thing is. Look at that. This is uh, a double smash burger. We're about to put this on the uh, on the menu. Oh, okay. Okay. So, You're, so this is not on the menu yet. Not yet. Uh, so it's an exclusive here yes. with us. All right. <laughs> we come prepared, April. Thank you. I appreciate. <laughs> I appreciate that. We, you know, things are always breaking with us here on Live in the D, and yep. I appreciate the fact that you're debuting that with us this morning, yes, so that looks delicious. Yes. And the burgers are never frozen, same thing, it's uh, never frozen. I love it. so much better that way. All right, Bob, I've been waiting. Yep, I've been I've waiting. Been waiting I, I, I've got to do this. <laughs> I've got to do it. Mm. That's mm. a white cheddar sauce with a cavatappi uh, noodle, and then with the buffalo chicken, gets a little bit of spice in there, mm -hmm. so it's, it's a good mixture. This is delicious. I've never had my mac and cheese done just quite like this. This is good. Oh, <clears throat> I feel a little kick right there. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. So like you said, your your food is all made with fresh ingredients. Yes. Um, and you have a, a pretty large menu. I mean, this is not like your average bar food. No, we try to go upscale bar food. So mm -hmm. everything's fresh. Um, we try to start with good ingredients, right? Mm -hmm. That's kind of the main thing. Mm -hmm. uh, but it is pub food. But I call it good pub, pub food. So Good pub uh, food. Yeah. All right, so what I like about this place here is that um, the kiddos can, you know, play video games and the parents can kick back and eat and just well enjoy some cocktails. You know, it's, it's, it's nice to come <laughs> out and dine with the family, but it's also nice for mom and dad to kind of have that a long time. And so I love Absolutely. the fact you've got the arcade and everything going on. Yeah, so we have 30 uh, vintage arcade games. They're all from mm -hmm. the 80s and 90s. Um, so a person of my age, I'm kind of reliving my high school years. Yes. Um, so back in the 80s, they cost you a quarter. Um, here they're free. So if you buy food and drinks, we'll give you tokens. Um, it's 10 tokens for every $10 you spend. Mm -hmm. If that's not enough, they do accept quarters too. Okay. So you can continue the fun. Uh, what's always great here is that it's fun to see 10 and 12, 14 year old kids enjoy the games that I enjoy. Mm -hmm. Even though the games on your phone are probably far more powerful or the graphics are better. Nothing like they still these. Love these the are classics. Stuff. Yes, They're absolutely. classics. Gallagher, yeah, Miss Pac Man, those are awesome I, games I, to play. I love it. All right. So we know you dropped some food off back at the station, and we're going to head back there now with Tati and Blaine. So you had a, a special dish for Tati. We know our girl is gluten free, <laughs> yes. and so we looked out for her. So talk to me and tell me what do they have there. So we have a Michigan salad there uh, that's romaine lettuce. Um, it's got mm. dried cherries. Uh, the candy pecans to me was really separates the the dish, mm -hmm. and then the gorgonzola um, cheese. It's kind of a blue cheese family, but it's not quite as uh, potent or strong. Yeah. And then it's got a uh, raspberry vinaigrette with it. So. Wow! Wow! So we're and gonna. It's got grilled chicken on it too. It so. looks lovely, guys. Enjoy it. it looks lovely. Well, April, thank you so much. Uh, all this food looks good. Blaine's burger looks good. You're we're welcome. gonna dig in during commercial break. Yes, we break. will. Thanks so much. All right.